General Hospital's priorities that things could get messy going forward, and this mess involved a fight over custody of two children. Alyssa Davis' family has the problem Alyssa's and Christina Corinto Davis will both gain custody of their two babies, Violet and Christina Baby. Let's talk about Christina Babies first. Christina agrees to be a surrogate for Molly Lawson Davis and T.J. Asford. Christina agreed to give the baby to the couple Molly and T.J. after the baby was born. Christina has an agreement with them, and Christina is in the final days of her pregnancy. Christina is about to go into labor, but what T.J. forces Christina to stay away from Corin Sonny Corinto, Christina has second thought. Along with that, T.J. and Molly's relationship has also been shaken and they may divorce. Christina may think about taking custody of the baby and canceling the agreement. Christina absolutely wins if a trial takes place. Or rather, there may be no trial at all and Christina succeeds in getting the baby. Molly is a prosecutor and Molly knows she has no authority whatsoever regarding Christina's baby. Because Molly was not the ex-donor for Christina's surrogacy process, but only that the law in New York will only recognize T.J. and Christina as the child parents if a dispute actually occur. Although Christina won custody of the baby, it was certain that the family relationship of the Davis sister will fall apart. Meanwhile, the Alice's will also gain custody of Violet. In terms of relationship, Alyssa and Violet have nothing to do with each other, but Alyssa has a reason to take custody of Violet. First of all, if Hamilton Finn is really not capable of raising Violet anymore, then Harrison Chase and Brooklyn Quarterman will raise Violet. However, Chase and Brooklyn's custody of Violet will not be legal without a trial. Not to mention the fact that Finn could die suddenly, and not give custody of Violet to anyone. Brooklyn and Chase are also a new couple and they really want a baby of their own. Although raising Violet is a good thing, Violet could also be the person that prevents Brooklyn from Chase from having a baby of their own. They feel pressure to care for Violet and think about not having children during this time or before his death. Finn and Chase severe their family relationship so Chase has nothing to do with his niece anymore. Elizabeth Webber would also want to be Violet Guardian. Liz had previously had that idea, but if Violet becomes Liz's adopted child, no financial difficulty will occur. Although the fortune that Finn left Violet is quite large, perhaps Liz is not allowed to touch that fortune. Plus, Liz is a single mother at this point and Liz has all the kids. The pressure of raising Violet will be the different for Liz to bear. Meanwhile, Melissa can afford to raise Violet and will want to become Violet Guardian if Finn really dies. By then, Alyssa would have gone back to being a lawyer and Alyssa would actually own Finn and Rekri Chase a thank you. Melissa want to repay them by taking care of Finn's daughter as well as Rekri's granddaughter. Alyssa is going to experience the feelings of taking care of a child because Alyssa hasn't felt that in a long time. Alyssa and Christina both ended up having their own custody battle, but has also got the Davis family into serious trouble. Their family relationships fall apart if the Davis family gets two new members.